41 mitzvahs, 14 positive mitzvahs, and 27, 27 negative mitzvahs. It says here, in my homage it says 41, in Moshe Chaim's homage it says 51. Who wow. write with the pen here? Ah, uh, you write it. All right, you should check it. Good. One of the mitzvahs, the first mitzvah, for the Jewish people, when they're going in the entering Eretz Israel, shoiftim, we show it is shoiftim? Judges. Judges. We show it to him? Officers. 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 Police people. Police. Should give it in every gate where the Rebbeinu Shel Olam noise lecha lishvatecha the mitzvahs. The Rebbeinu should give it to you. We shove to his arm mishpat tzedek. They should judge the people mishpat tzedek. This is one of the parashiyas you, you read always. Which month? Chodesh Elul. Elul. Who can figure out where it says Elul in this pasuk? Shmuel, without the Chumash, you can't figure it out. <laughs> Who can figure out where it says in this pasuk Chodesh Elul? It's probably the first letter. Break Chumash. Break Chumash here. If that Chumashim, you can't figure it out. It's not the first letter. I'll give you a hint already. On the first letter, don't look. Okay, so it's the first letter of every word. That's the L. Well, eh, you are on the right. Lechal ishvatecha? No. That's Elul. Where? Elul kacha. Lechal ishvatecha. That's Elul. No. It says hundred percent the word Elul, not half. Lechal ishvatecha veshavtu s. That's Elul. Aleph vav. Lamed in a Lamed. Right. Elul. Yeah, Rabbi. Rabbi, yeah? Where is it exactly? Lecha. In the first. First pasuk. Shoiftim v'shoitrim. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, Asher Hashem Eloikecha. Here. Lecha is a. What's this? Lamed. No, ten. Lamed. Nishvatecha. Lamed, Lamed. Nishavtu. Vav. S. Aleph. Aleph. It's together. Aleph. Lamed. In a Vav, in a Lamed, is Elul. Right? Yeah. You agree with this, Mr. Shmuel? No? Do you agree with this? Not yet. Beginning of the word, the end of the word, the, the beginning of the word. Lecha, lishvatecha, lamed, lamed, veshav tu vav, es is an aleph. Put together this. Aleph, lamed, vav, lamed is elul. It's 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 backwards. Listen. Oh, it's not even. It's not even. Okay. It doesn't even backwards. It's not even backwards. Just four letters in a row. Four, four letters, letters in a row. Was giving it together the word Elul. Elul. Now, why the Torah brings in this first pasuk the word Elul? Rashi says. <laughs> Rashi says. Good. The children on the Sharecha of the. Uh, go for whatever, yeah. Let, let's, um, let's, let's learn together the Pasuk. Shoiftim, mm-hmm. no, what judges? The Shoiftim give policemen. Titel Lecha, right? She give for you, Bechol Shorecha, in every gate, Asher Hashem Eloikecha, where the Revolution gives, right? 
Noisen Lecha. Right? He says, one time, Titan Lecha? Yeah. Titan Lecha, give for you, and every gate with the Rebbeinu Shiloilam, Noisen Lecha, give to you. Right? So, uh, the word Noisen Lecha is, you don't need it here. Uh-huh. Everyone knows you talk in the Rebbeinu Shiloilam, the Rebbeinu gives you the whole world. Shoyftim v'shoytrim, Titan Lecha, Bechal Shorecha, Asher Hashem Adoykecha. Noisen. What is Noisen Lecha? What gift to you? It says Titan Lecha. Gift to you is ready. Lecha all about. Two times Lecha. Shmuel, you asked? What he gives twice? Shoyftim v'shoytrim, Titan, you give Lecha to the country, with the Rebbeinu Shiloilam, give it to you. Listen to what The Shalai Kodesh says, every town, every city has gates. Right? Every city has. Trump tried to throw down the gates. He tries to close down. The borders, the gates, no way. Let's close the gates. Close the gates. Good afternoon, Mr. Cohen. I promise you can get. Where can I get it? Rabbi, it's my salts. Help out, I promise. Salts, sorry. But says the Shalom Hakadosh, the Rebbeinu the Shalom, like he gave you gates. He gave gates every time. Town, city has gates to close down. The Reboi Nishloilam give for everyone gates. The eyes. The ears. No? As gates? Yeah. Two gates. Good. The ears? Two. As gates. Two goes down. Two fingers. <laughs> give you gates no way. So you put them in your head. That's what you get the two pinkies for. Oh. Ah. Uh, says, I give you, for the tongue, I give you these nice. gates. Mm-hmm. In the mound gates. Okay. Have gates. Right. right? This is not Bill Gates. <laughs> this yeah. is Gates. It's Bill Gates. Yeah. The Reboi give for everyone gates. Right. With the same, the Reboi request in Chodesh Elul, you should put judges and police on your own gates. Where are you looking? What you hear? What your ears would you say? Hear from somebody else? Mm-hmm. What you mount? What you say? The Muslim says, put judges, not only physical judges. What's a. The Muslim says, Titan, no to who? Lecha. What's Lecha? To you. you. To you. Give it to you. Mm-hmm. Give it to you. Shoyftim v'shoytrim. Titen. Lecha. Lecho. Give it for you. Chodesh Elul is the months what everyone has to put for himself. Police and judges. This is the heen of Elul. And this is Titen. Lecha. Lecha. Give it to you. Then the Bishop said, if so, is the shaf to a psalm mishpat tzedek. I will judge you. Or the shone mishpat tzedek. Fair judges. If you people, if we, we, we not you, we, I will put them real judges. And the real police in ourself, and then the revolution says, the shaf to his arm, Mishpat Sedek. This is there. So Hashem is going to, is going to, to judge us with Mishpat Sedek. Mm-hmm. So Mishpat Sedek, that means with Rachamim. Rachamim, yeah. With Mishpat Sedek. So it says, Loisate Mishpat the next pasuk, mm-hmm. don't take bribe. Okay. Right? Mm-hmm. 
Why? כי השויכד יעבר, what is שויכד? No, makes what? Why? Why? ויסר לב דברי צדיקים, makes what? No. What is that? What does it Land. The the word of Sadiqim. I have a tremendous question. Why the Torah doesn't write, don't give Shoichat? The Torah talks about the judges here. What the Torah says, what the judges? Lotikach. Shouldn't take. Shouldn't take. Is it allowed to give? No. It doesn't say. Yes. What the Torah doesn't say? What? It says not to take. Is it allowed to give? Yes. No, who goes in jail? Both going in jail, no? The giver and the taker, no? Only the taker. No, no, it's not true. <laughs> you know, I tell you, the giver has give a, give a punishment mm -hmm. for the taker. Ah. Because like, you put a stone in the front of a blind man. Blind person. Blind person. Ah, right, right. Why, why the Torah says, don't give shoychad? Why do it says only not allowed to take Shoichat? If nobody gives, there's nobody to take. What? If there's nobody that gives, then there's nobody going to be able to take. No, therefore, it's always just right. Don't give and don't take. No, the opposite. If, if there's get, nobody to take, take there's nobody to give. Right. That's not necessarily money. To take, like the Gemara talks to take. about the most extreme yeah. cases where he says, I can't be your dying anymore because you just did a toy. Yeah. Is there an, is that level? It even this is not allowed. Is that also for the? Even that's not allowed. Then why Torah says only don't take? Torah so should write don't give. Also, I tell you, the Maral ah. says in one place, where Torah is not only a book of laws. Definitely the book of laws. But the Torah is also a prevention book. A prevention. Mm -hmm. Now, let's say if the Torah would say, don't give and don't take. Right? The Torah would say, which is mm -hmm. fairly. So don't give, don't take. <laughs> Probably in a silent way, in a quiet way, the whole world would be full with bribe. Why? This is good. Because nobody will admit he gave, nobody will admit he take. He took, right? Because it's allowed to give, not allowed to take. Now the Torah says, don't take, is the taker will be afraid always. If I will take, the another one will go publicize he gave me because for him he's allowed to give. Uh -huh. <laughs> you said for him he's allowed to give. Uh -huh. The taker will says, the taker will says, I'm not taking so it is. Tomorrow you go out, you publicize it to me, I get you gave me it. Uh -huh. If the toilet would wouldn't say not allowed to, to give, right? Mm -hmm. Is the all the world will be full with bribe. And the judge wouldn't be afraid to take mm -hmm. because he knows he will not admit he gave because he is not allowed us to give. The vote goes in jail. <laughs> so he says, no, 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 the giver doesn't go to jail. No, 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 no. He, he doesn't give to go to jail. So uh, who goes to jail? The taker. The taker. <laughs> Therefore, tomorrow, the taker will not take. He never take. Why? Because? Because the giver will go publish the paper. I gave him bribe. <laughs> I gave him bribe. So for him, he's allowed to give. <laughs> says that the man says, yeah. This is what the Torah is not only a law book. The Torah gave for the judge a prevention. So a prevention book, a prevention. <laughs> where the judge should never take bribe. We'll be afraid where the giver will go to publicize. For him, he's allowed to give. The Torah says he's not allowed to give. For him, he's allowed to give. Therefore, he will go to publicize this minatoire. Is no shoichad minatoire for the giver. Pash is in with the Rabbanon is not allowed to give. It's not allowed to give, allowed to take. But minatoire is allowed to give. Is allowed to give. 
Because mm-hmm. allowed to take. The Torah says the judge should be afraid to take. Because what was Shechaim? The man who he gives will go tomorrow, what will he say? They give it to me. I gave it. So, uh, therefore, the judge should be afraid to take. So the Torah, I leave you open for the giver, for him is allowed to give. Then he will not take. So it's allowed to give back sheesh. But, so good. It's yes. A, uh, isn't there an over and after of uh, Fine, good. We talk about on the Pasuk. On the Pasuk, we see the Shoichat. You're right. What is the Pshat is, Ki ha Shoichat yaver eine chachomim v'yisalev divrei tzadikim. What is divrei chachomim? The eyes of the chachomim and the divrei tzadikim. What will this? Explain to me. English. No, English. Was ki ha-shoich ha-yavere ne-chachomim? It's too hard for me. Oh, you explain it. I don't even have the words. The bribe makes blind the eye of the wise people. And the Yisalef, it should be changed. Yisalef is changed, right? Different, the word of the tzaddikim. Tell you a story. The shach. One of the comments of the Shach, famous commentary, is on Chosh Mishpat. Chosh mm-hmm. Mishpat is the book of laws, or the finance laws. Shach was a young man, and he gave out his book without a name. Nobody knew you with this. Nobody knew who it is. He was a young man, <coughs> everyone knew, knew in town, he's a smart man. But the safer, nobody knew you, he gave it out. Came one day to him, two people, for a dispute, financial dispute. All right, Shach was listening. So A says this, B says that. So, uh, and he heard everything, and he says, A is right. B was a Chochem. He says, Rabbi, I don't know, came out lately a book. And I can show you it's written in the book. I am right. Shach didn't know the word. Show me. He goes to the cabinet, takes out the book. He opens the book. And it says there, what B is right, not A is right. The Shach was furious. He knew you. This is his book. It was his book. He write in his book what B is right. And now came a case and he says A is right. He says, you know what? Come back tomorrow. Come back tomorrow. This is the way. Come back tomorrow. Also you were right. What? No, 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 no. This is a serious thing. He writes in the in case. In his book, in his own book, we yeah. printed a few months ago, was B is right, mm-hmm. and now he says in public, A is right. He says for both A and B, come back tomorrow. Mm-hmm. You know, the rabbi has a coat, it was winter, take his coat, put it in his coat, and he goes home. Yeah. And the way home, he puts his hands in his pocket, Uh-oh. he found in his pocket $20 bill. No. <laughs> wow. Twenty dollar bill. What good luck. So, a twenty dollar bill. No, I'm Start to think from where yeah. I have this twenty dollars. Yeah. He asks his wife, his family. Yeah. I don't know where the money is. Yeah. He was thinking, thinking, <clears throat> thinking, until he came to him to a conclusion. <laughs> what a before the case. Before he, came, he entered the courtroom, he left his coat outside. He put in his pocket twenty dollars, mm-hmm. and even he didn't know about that. Mm-hmm. Bribe is so strong, even you don't know about that. 
Even if you don't know, it's only in your possession, right? Says the Shach is changing your mind. Oh. Not only changing your mind, says the Shach, even you write in the book, in your own book, B is right, mm -hmm. right? Bright, without knowing about this, change your mind what you write by yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I never turned the money and changed my mind. <laughs> story, is, story is good? Mm -hmm. So this is the Pshat in Pasuk here. Mm -hmm. The Torah says, Ki ha-shoichad ye'aver e'nech ha-chomim makes blind the eye of the wise people, oh. but also v'yisalev divrei. What's that? Divrei tzadikim. If a tzadik write in his book, divrei oh. tzadikim, a tzadik write in his book, what B is right, the bribe is so strong, even if it doesn't know about this, if you also change the judgment. <laughs> this is what says, V'yisalev divrei tzadikim. This is like a shoichad makes blind the eye of the wise people, is one thing. Number two, V'yisalev divrei, what divrei, what's the the world, he writes bees. The words, the words he writes in his book. What uh, really B is right? Mm -hmm. Hey, put him with his coat, something outside. No oh. words. Mm -hmm. I want to tell you. I said it was is a is a prominent lawyer in town here. This is true story, okay. a true, a true story, a Jewish, from lawyer, Why? lawyer in town here. <laughs> so, uh, he had in a certain state, no, in a certain county. Mm -hmm. He has a court case. In a court case between A and B was a heavy, heavy court case. Mm -hmm. And he was the lawyer for B. That's a serious lawyer for B. B is supposed to be to go few years in jail. It was a, a, a financial something. It's no way. Was a, it was a hard, tough case. Tough case. And this lawyer was the lawyer for B. In the family, it was a rich family. And they told for them, this lawyer, if he can make it easier, not five years, one year, he will get a lot of money for it. Mm -hmm. Right. No, the family told for the, for the lawyer. This is a bribe. Not bribe. No, the lawyer, lawyer can do whatever he wants. What? He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. He's it's not a, the judge, family, a lawyer. It's a lawyer. The family told for the lawyer. All right. Came the court case. You know, it's a long court case, and the judge says, another day, another day, for hearing another day. The guy, the lawyer, took me the, took, uh, spoke with the judge, spoke with the judge, and the judge told him, what is he talking? He likes certain food the Jewish people eat, forget his name, no? No. Bacon. What difference does it make? He put in, in, inside the bread a salami for meat. Cold cuts. Cold cuts cheap. Pastrami. Jewish pastrami. He likes Jewish pastrami. Smoked meat. A Jewish, like a. I mean, this is in talking, you know. Uh, the, giant, the lawyer came back in the same day. So, uh, and. He went to Lamberg Yerosaman <laughs> and he made a really very nice packages, a few pages of pastrami, very nice. No, uh, very nice. But he didn't bring the pickle. <laughs> and is it, I'm telling you, this is a true story. You should know where. Uh, and you know, and. Uh, in the morning, before the court case, he went into the judge's office, 
and he has to talk something with the judge, and he put in the judge's uh, suitcase. Uh, briefcase. Yeah. In the briefcase, baby. Briefcase. He puts pastrami, this pastrami. Pastrami sandwich. Pastrami, not the sandwich. The nice pastrami made it. Uh, made it. And that's it. So. Uh, <laughs> Smell, don't tell me the stories. Well, yeah, I know exactly about that. I'm telling you what the story is. Em is the gemaisa. It's no word. It's not only a joke here. The guy, instead of five years, went out with three months. Oh. Oh. Not one year, just three months. Not three months. That's terrific. This is what's called shoichad. Even the judge doesn't know about it. In the shoichad, is this possession, right? Yeah. It's affect the judgment. Wow, that's a neat trick. That's a neat trick. Now the out? question is, if it's allowed, you ask a very good question. Is allowed to give for a non-Jewish judge, mm. right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Wow. Mm. Is allowed. Is allowed to give an on a pro no. Rabbi Isai? Probably not. He's no. right. Is <laughs> not allowed to give. But I will tell you a very interesting story. Not a story. This, what we're telling you now, is going back in Chubas Chavas Yoyer. This was written about nearly 350 years ago. Mm -hmm. It was a very Prominent Gentile. Ask them Chavasyoy, ask him a question. He asked him, I know is not allowed to give bribe. <laughs> Don't worry. And the aloha from bribe is doesn't matter if the guy is Jewish or not Jewish. For a Jew, he's not allowed to give bribe for a judge. This is aloha. This is aloha. No words. He asked him, I have a question to you. He says, why would a Jewish man, so is going with a Gentile, is there a, a dispute? A dispute. Mm -hmm. Is always the Jew, but the Jewish people say, this was a try, how you can bribe the judge? How you can bribe the judge to your side? How you can bribe the judge to your side? Right? So is. In the Chavasyoi answer, I'll tell you. A simple answer. When a Jew is going with a, going with a Gentile, to the judge, right? Mm -hmm. So it is. In the, the judge, a Gentile, obvious, he is looking more, his brother, 90% of his right. 10% he gives right for the Jew, right? So it is. You have to balance it. It should be 50 50. Mm -hmm. No, how you balance it? You go back right. You bribe the judge. Then the judge, before the case, is balancing the uh, decision. The decision. Oh. Then he asks him, tell me, then why when two Jewish people go in the judge and everyone tried to buy the judge? What's happened there? Oh. And he said, it's not bribe because everyone gives. <laughs> Bribe is only if one gives, not one doesn't give. But if both giving, uh, both giving the same, is no way. Uh, By the way, the Allah is even both giving bribe is not allowed. It's not. Not allowed. Right. Of course not. Can't even. Not yeah. allowed for a. This is Allah Chosh Bishpat. It's no way. Uh, not allowed to uh, give for a gentle judge uh, bribe. It's allowed even. Two people, everyone bribes the same, it's also not allowed. Because, I'll tell you why. Senate, Senate. No. No? Okay. Not because, uh, this. not only because Tzedek, Tzedek, the past success, Kia Mishpat, no? The judgeness is doesn't come because the judge. Uh -huh. Decide in this way or that way. The bribe, it, the, the judgeness, it, the Reboi Shiloilam gives for the judge in his mind the right decision. Kia Mishpat, Lekimu. 
the bribe is you mixing in and you bat in a decision for the Rebbeinu Shalayram. It's a higher. It's not like today a code. We're talking about a really a real code. The decision doesn't come come somewhere from higher authority. Mm-hmm. So uh, is therefore when giving judge to try to money or something else to go in is not only to change the judge decision. This is try to change whose decision? Okay. Oh. Mishpat? Okay. Now one person is allowed to bribe. Uh, one is allowed to bribe. So uh, I'm not saying is allowed to allow to bribe the wife. I'm not saying about this. I'm not talking about this. So, uh, who is allowed to bribe? The Reboi de Shiloilam. The Reboi de Shiloilam is allowed to bribe. How do you bribe the Reboi You do mitzvahs, <laughs> you do masim toivim, <laughs> you learn, you daven, you give tzedakah, you bribe him. <laughs> So uh, <laughs> you can bribe the Rebbeinu Shalom. He's allowed to bribe him. He lets you to bribe him. I don't like the word bribe. <laughs> what? What do you like the word? Bribe? No, because you do the mitzvahs from your heart. Donation. Donation. Oh, it's donations. Not, kind of you take him. You take him. You take him to your site. You take him to your site. Okay. The Satan comes from one side, right? You take the Rebbeinu to your side. This is allowed. Yes, Rabbi Yosef. What? You can daven. You can do mitzvahs. You can do many things. You take the Rebbeinu to your side. So, therefore, this person comes with Chodesh Elul. What happens? Tzedakah. Yeah. Tzedakah is the way. Is allowed. To bribe the Rebbeinu Shalom. Camera. Why How many people come to Aguda to force Good. 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 It's no way. This is so you is makes the person blind and also takes away things with the Tzadik right in his book. The Shoichad changed it. Mm. A saying was one time the old judge. The old judge. And the old judge didn't hear so well. It was an old man. Didn't hear so so well. Mm-hmm. So, uh, mm-hmm. He put the voices in his ear. Doesn't matter. Mm. It didn't hear so well. It's no way. It's uh, elderly people. It's not going to happen. One day, he has a court case. In front of him, two parties. Uh, and he says, you know, A is right, B is wrong. B was very offended for the, for the judgment. Yeah. And he wanted to say something. He says, listen, the judge didn't understand. It's no way. It's, a Torah says what if somebody takes bribe, right? What he became? Blind. Blind. How you can become deaf? <laughs> you want to hear? Uh, yeah. The judge was very smart. He says, I become deaf. From the people who are promising bribe and doesn't give it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Get. <laughs> you don't believe the story? Say, when I be. I thought Wasser and Lemberg were lawyers from the beginning, but now I know for sure. <laughs> but Torah Gdoisha says, okay. in the next parsha is a parsha from the king. Ah. Oh, yeah. Torah says, 
You come to the land. You anchor the land. You sit there. And therefore you see him, you say, Osima Olai, no? Melech. So the Torah is, so him to Osima Olai a Melech. You can put in yourself a Melech. He said, again, you know why you read it in Chodesh Elul? Why no? Hashem is the Melech. Now the time, what you really, the Rebbein is the Melech. This is the reason why you come to Shul Rosh Hashanah in the morning, you the chasn, what the chasn says at the beginning? Hamelech. Right? This is the parsha from the Melech. The Torah, or the Melech, fine. You can ask a Melech, the Melech shouldn't have too many horses and not too many wives. Pasuk Yutches. Look in the Pasuk Yutches. Pasuk 18. Thank you. Let's together. Vahaya. Keshivtoi. Al Kisei Mamlachto. What's it mean? When he's sitting on his. As he sits, what's he keshif toy? Uh, and then what he has to be kosav loy? As mishne atoyre azois, he has to write the mishne atoyre azois al sefer, right? Good from a book. Milifne akoyanim alevim. This pasuk you have to understand. Number one. What Reb David gave a hint on it. What's mean keshiftoi? What's it keshiftoi? What's the English book here? English Why? Why beshiftoi? No. The English boy. What's English keshiftoi? As he As he says, when he sits. When he sits on the throne. What is What says? When he sits. When he says, article says, when he sits on the throne of his kingdom. Then he says, when he sits on the throne of his kingdom. Not keshiftoi. No, the article is wrong. No. <laughs> what it says here? No? Why are it, it, like like my my throne, Hashem's throne. Like his throne, like a, compared to Hashem's he, throne. When he sits on the is as to then the Pasuk says, Why are toy? Not Keshif toy. Actually, that's listen good. <laughs> He says something like that. about this. No, no. no nothing. No, something Rashi. Rashi says, in Masa Cain, if you do it this, mm -hmm. it, his kingdom will stay. This is what Rashi says. But for your keshif, I tell you, yeah. the mitzvahs.
the mitzvahs.